All right, guys, what's up? Got back from grocery shopping. That's the video, I promise y'all. Just a quick trick, quick run. It actually came out to only $30. By the way, shout out to B Sales for the shirt. Actually, you know, hugs the sleeves. Uh, so I got some tuna. Let me get the tuna out of the way first. I got some tuna for my, my, my salad. I like making salads with corn, mixed veggies, mayo, and boiled eggs. So I need a lot of tuna for that. That's the only, to be honest, the only time I could actually eat tuna is when it's with corn and in the, in the, in the chicken salad or some shit. Other than that, I just hate the consistency of tuna. It's so dry. I'm a consistency guy. All right, um, got me some mackerel. Tried out, got this from my uncle. It's actually pretty good. Um, smells like sardines a bit, but it's actually pretty good. And you get 12 grams of protein per serving, and it comes with five servings. So it's about, you know, you know, 50 something, uh, let's say 60 grams of protein for just this right there. Uh, usually I stir fry it and I uh, mix it with onions and stuff like that. Really good. Got me cucumber for my dildo. It's fucking chill. It's for my sushi. Um, some onions. Once again, think about bodybuilding. The keto keep your nutrition on point in bodybuilding. So find ways to make the same boring foods taste good, right? So I get onions, garlic. Whatever seasoning I could use to make my food taste better. Because, guys, to be honest, I really hate... First of all, I got a bad appetite. That's bad enough. Then I hate eating the same shit all the time, except sushi. So you got to find ways to make your chicken leg quarters or your ground beef taste different so you don't get bored, right? Um, I got me some heavy whipped cream for my chicken alfredo, right? Some days I'm going to stir fry my chicken with onions. Some days I'm going to make a chicken alfredo style. I said, just a quick one, not special. And I say, I got me some cabbage. Once again, I can eat this with chicken. If I eat chicken with uh, the chicken alfredo today, the next day it could be stir fry with cabbage. Just find ways to switch stuff up. Guys. If you still want me to make recipe videos, let me know. I just, I just get lazy every now and then. Um, and last but not least, I got me some tangerine. Just for my citrus, right? You got to have your food in your diet. You got to get your citrus. Uh, another thing that citrus does, a lot of people don't know about this is, it helps your body, it helps your liver detoxify estrogen, which is great, guys. You don't want that estrogen circulating all over your fucking blood, especially when you fat like me. So, got me a lot of uh, oranges. Mandarins, I should say, because oranges were too expensive. Pretty much the same thing. Plus, helps you alkal um, alkal alkalinize your body. I cannot pronounce that word for shit. And my lemons are obviously here. Can't go wrong with fruits, guys. Nature has everything you need. And that's it, guys. Uh, what else I got? Mm, yeah. I got my chicken leg orders. Once again, me and my uncle are doing big research because we really, <laughs> we really think there's something wrong with chicken leg orders, guys. It has to be that one retarded chicken or it has to be the fucking, the, one, the chickens that are missing chromosomes or whatever because this is 10 pounds for $6, six and change, which is... Unbelievable, guys. If you study economics, there's no way they're making a profit unless this is literally, like I said, a chromosome missing ass chicken. It has to be, guys, because this is 10 pounds for $6. And if you buy chicken drums separately, you get like 10, no, like eight for like probably eight or nine bucks, guys. So this makes no sense. But hey, guys, we have no choice. Live in America, you gotta eat what you're given. If you live in those poor countries, then you you in the best atmosphere to build muscle because your food doesn't have hormones in it, doesn't have too many pesticides. It takes longer to, to, you know, to produce it, but hey, at least you're eating healthy shit. So I got this, and, um, and plus, Hans has been, me and my father always say this, Hans has been eating this shit for over a year, and so far, so far, he doesn't have any, any, any uh, visible defects. <laughs> so, I guess it's good. I got me some eggs. Once again, I make eggs in the morning. Every morning. That's my salsa leucine, my cheap salsa leucine. And I also make boiled eggs eat with my chicken salad. So that's it, guys. That's what I got from the grocery store. I just got to clean up the fridge a little bit and make room for that, all right? So if you want the cooking videos, let me know. If not, then... Oh, don't forget to like the video. Now, fuck you. I'm out. All right, guys. Just woke up. Did my little jump bro jog and all that shit. And I'm about to give my first cold shower a try. This is not my first thing. My second one. The first one didn't really count because I cheated. That shit was just too much, man. It was too painful, guys. I'm African, man. We're used to the heat. But, uh, so this is our official first 